Hey guys, what's up? It is Kill Everything 32 here, and I am here with a brand new series for my Xbox 360 um, gameplays. And this game is called Rage. Um, I don't know too much about this game. I did play it just a little bit a long time ago. I kind of fell out of it really quickly. Um, apparently, it's a first-person shooter set in a apocalyptic wasteland, and I think this game came out 2013-ish. Um, it doesn't say on the case, but it's made by, um, ID Tech 5 Labs, um, Bethy Bethesda and Zenimax, so I'm guessing it's going to be pretty good. Um, Dolby and Microsoft both worked together on this. It won over 20 E3 awards, so I'm assuming it has to be a really good game. Um, it comes from the people who made, like, the Doom series and Quake, so, um, I don't know too much about it. I know it's really good, though, from what I've seen. Um, so, I actually have the Anarchy Edition, too, and this game is actually a three-disc set. Um, the first two discs are all campaign, and the third one's just strictly for multiplayer, which I know it says multiplayer right there, but um, that's just... It'll, if you click it, it'll tell you to pop in the third disc. But um, this is just going to be simple campaign play, so not too much exciting stuff, but at the same time, there will be... So, um, I did turn on subtitles because this is one of those games where, if you don't pay attention, um, you'll get lost pretty easily. I also, for my Xbox stuff, I made a new account for my videos. So, while, um, my, uh, Left 4 Dead 2 series that I'm doing with my cousin, that one will still stay the same. All the other ones, I'll be earning achievements as I play, um, with a brand new profile. So, this way, it's all kind of a clean slate. Um, difficulty wise, I'm not gonna get too. I'm not gonna go with easy because that's just kind of worse, but I'm not gonna go full on nightmare because that'd be kind of insane. So I'm probably gonna go with just a normal um, setting and kind of see how all this goes. I remember like the first 10 minutes, if that, of this game. So there you go. Bethy B. Sus Software presents. It's a really intense moment of the game. It's almost... So it's talking about the comic book hashing. I actually don't know if my subtitle is still turned on, like it should be or not. ID software. I honestly don't know if this is... Oh, okay. Whoa. Okay, then. A little different, to say the least. That is a huge asteroid. And it's just tearing the room apart. I think this game was actually based off of um. Um. That's my character. But, um, I do believe this game was set up. Try not to talk to anything in important moments. But, um, I think this game was actually set up and made to be about the idea of what would happen if an asteroid actually did hurt, hit Earth. And what we could try to do to stop it. Okay, so it's 160 years after the impact, I think, is what I was telling me there. Alright, so something happened. That'd be me. Oh. Okay, so this is already looking pretty intense. I don't remember much about this game. It was so long ago since I played. Um, what's it want me to do? Okay, look up. Down. Yeah. Okay, so it was just asking me right there if I wanted to go invert, which I don't do. Whoa. This isn't good. I think a lot of these guys didn't make it. 
I do so. He needs to die for Okay. What am I Okay then, so, we were last, okay, wow, okay, then I'm really, from how this looks right now, I'm Mankind's last living person, like, I highly doubt, because you know how all games go. Um, okay, that's bright. Interesting. It looks like a ginormous rock quarry. Which I think this is, um... Wow, this is all part of the wasteland. It looks like this was built after the asteroid, but was disbanded once the Ark was found. It'd be my guess, anyways. Nope, don't want to go down there. Right, that's killing. Right here. Holy crap! Jesus. What the hell? This isn't good at all. <laughs> I, I wonder if this guy's on my side or not. I hope so. Hey you! Over here! I think so. There we go. Jesus Christ. Nope, oh, I got money. Where'd the other guy go? There we go. It ain't safe here. Get in. I know you got questions, but we gotta get moving. Okay. Got the end of the solar missiles. Who does get going? Probably a good idea. I'm Dan Hager, and you with one lucky son of a bitch. Thank you. <laughs> you know, our survivors are worth a lot of money to whoever hands them over to the authority. Wait. You don't even know the authority yet. I feel like that thing is like a connection to Halo. To this is crap. Well, I mean, at least they can still fly, so that's good. Uh, this isn't. Uh oh. This isn't good. Is there anything good? Pretty much their world out here. Probably looking for their bodies. Oh, man. Damn. Now we've all found a problem. Yeah, this isn't good. I, I have a feeling that because you saved my life, What's I'm gonna have to do something for you. So that's how all these games go. People save your life and you have to do something for them. Really crap. Well, it looks like this kind of set in like Nevada or Utah because of the rocks. That's cool. It'd be part of. I do have to say, like whenever I saw people play this game, it did look really interesting. I think I just couldn't get into it right away. Because apparently in the beginning there was a lot of running around and doing kind of pointless missions for people. But I think now things are gonna be better. Okay, I'll get out. Or why that was Y instead of A though, that's a bit different. Well then I guess it makes sense that A was to get in and Y was to get out. Really beat up or not. Ooh, nice one there. I want it. It will be mine. I actually have no idea. I think he actually does give you this. This is about as far as I got in, that's it. So I can't say too much. You know. I put a lot of risk to save you. Not just my life, but the lives of everyone. That was dumb of you. 
I survived this long by staying out of trouble. Saving you may have changed all that. I'll get to that, don't worry. So here's what I need you to do. Head to where those bandits live and wipe them out. Plain and simple. Okay, then. No one walks out alive. Except you. This is gonna get intense quickly. TVs in the garage, and that pistol, and the supplies on the table. Oh, and you won't just get my thanks. So, talk is cheap and one action is needed. First, take this fine on the counter. Okay, so I need to. Oh, okay then. Nice pistol. I hear there's something special. Where how many? Inside the chamber. Oh, that's not new, man. Okay, then. Dossier. Alright, so I have bandages that's been given. And some data for engineering. I'm guessing that's crafting. And there's my armory. So that's how many pistols I have. Pistol rounds. Standard issue. Pistol ammo. I'll get you to kill mutants and mutants and bandits eventually. Oh, the other types. Oh, that's cool. That boy, it's double the size, double the damage by half the rounds. That's worth it. Bullets with it. Oh, okay, so like shotgun shell for those. Fat mamas. Oh, so those are like. So you have regular bullets, and then you have fat boys, which is basically like two bullets. And then fat mamas, which is like four bullets. That's great. And then you have kill burst. And then you have your fist, but I don't know if that would be good for much killing unless you're on ammo. Um, oh, okay, here's my job list then. So that's what I gotta do right now. And it'll tell me what my objective is. I said, oh, okay, so that's overall. So it is it. I have one of one. Oh, okay, that's how my character looks. Why well, he looks old? <laughs> I have zero of 19 recipes, zero of 54 cards, zero of 18 vehicle jumps. Best. Okay, I probably should be looking at this because this is basically like giving a giveaway of what there is, but. I'm assuming that's okay right now because I've only played this game for 10 minutes. <laughs> Alright, so I gotta go get on this ATV. Oh, I do get to drive this. Awesome. Oh, it's third person drive. Gas reverse. Alright, so steering is like every other. Okay, so it's like stuff like every other game there is. And then X to boost. Oh, okay, that's cool. Oh, okay. The, the controls in this are actually really, really simple. I'm surprised. That's that's worrisome. I wonder if it's supposed to be that way. What the hell is that? I wanna hit it! Oh wait, there's no way. Okay. I think you can hit that, but I don't know what it is. That actually kinda makes me think though. Oh, there's another one. I guess I crumbled up highway too. There's where I just came okay, that's where I just came from, man. Why am I going past it, I wonder? I think all these different blue areas that you see on the mini map are like ways and entrances to entering something else. Oh, here's a bandit's place. Uh, statues don't help this much. They're actually really scary, the statues there. Um really worrisome actually. <laughs> I really don't know how to feel about the statues because they're really creepy. Oh, so why is he jumping the scene? More, well, why can't I bomb him out then? Oh, well, I guess, yeah, if rounds aren't cheap then I guess that makes sense at the same time. Okay then. Wait, what did I get stuck on? I'm not stuck anymore. Oh, yeah, okay, there we go. That worked, this scared me for a second. Cross this rickety old bridge over like nothing. Oh, okay. So it's sprinting still saying at least. A really small aiming radical. The ghost hideout. This is gonna be something, isn't it? Oh, there's no jump scares. Oh, okay then. They just look like a barrel of fun. I actually think they're really hard to kill and they're easy. I don't know. I know the other case though, it's gonna be. They, they're so creepy. Ah. Okay, so we're in the hideout now.
I'm sorry guys. Um I should have mentioned at the beginning of the video. I have this really, really bad allergy problem right now. I don't know why, because I've never had before, but my nose is like on the inside burning really badly. So I was just like pulling my you can move corpses. Okay, sorry, I learned how to do that then. So, that worries me though. Why is he dead right there at the very entrance? Oh, I guess that they're trying to make a statement, but then again, who would sneak it? Oh, yes! Food! Food! I don't know what food does for you in this game. I think you can sell it for money. This is a game you don't have to eat. I don't think. Oh, it's the blind. That from my time? That's scary. And they also have a lot of balloons around here too. I've noticed that a lot of things here that like are up in the air are just simple hot air balloons. Everything else is like all cool kick a technology. Which oh, I got a spray can. Oh, I got beer too. Let's have a party. Is that the way you're supposed to be? Yeah. That's why to jump. That feels so weird, because I'm so used to, like, A to jump. Oh, sweet, more bandages and ammo. Radio. Grindable. Oh, I need a lock grinder? I don't know, how am I going to need a lock grinder? There's an enemy around here. Where is he? Chase it down! Uh oh. Well, that was easy. That's a terrifying. Oh, but this group. That's a terrifying weapon that he's getting. I think it was just like. That's so creepy. Oh, okay, exiting. That's so creepy, though. Like, the way he just parkour was so unnecessary, but still. I'm not trying to sneak around here. I don't know how much this is. A lot of ghost symbols, though, but I guess that makes sense since it's ghost territory. Crimson aerosol, more small. Um, cloth rags. Those are helpful. Anything behind this desk? Oh. A book. I got a survival guide. What else is that here? I don't know if I got that anymore. Nope. Uh, I can't tell. Yeah. Jump. There we go. Um, uh, let's see here. I think I'm probably just gonna play up to that first saving point. Or I might do this mission. It might be really long episode if I do that though, because I'm already 17 minutes in, and I don't even know how far this goes. I'll get out of here. Nope, missed. I'm not good enough for your parkour. There we go. It's so weird though how they have those curved like machete blades. That was terrible though, it took me that long to kill him. I swear. Like I that was so scary though. He's jumping out of nowhere. Okay, there's a lot of unnecessary amount of skulls. Like, I understand that it goes like Jesus! Uh that was easy. I'm like, trying to be really conservative with my ammo, because knowing this is a wasteland, I really don't want to use too much and run out. Shut up! There we go. Two dollars. I was like, really? They have really little money for ban- Oh, I guess it makes sense why they'd be bandits if they have little money. That's why I didn't do it. I really fought- Whoa! Uh-oh. Not good, not good, not good. No 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 Yeah it says I'm good. Well well look at what Hagar said to us. How dare you think you can walk into our house? Take him to the kill Oh man. Not good, not good, not good. Ah, you're awake. Good. I like my prey to know what's coming. I promise this will hurt. Ow, that just was dark. I guess. Oh. Okay. Okay, okay then. This is gonna be complex. 
So I have to try to get all the white parts filled in as fast as I can and try to get as precise as possible. And then I guess there's shocks nearby enemies, so that's good. What, did I kill him? Oh, I did. Awesome. And I have pistol rounds. That's scary though, wow. A lot of dead bodies in there too. This, this game doesn't seem too gory, it's just emphasis on death right now, but I guess that's because it's... Ghost plans? Oh wait, is there a saving point? Can you save it from the menu? Oh, you can! Okay. Well, that's good. That means then I can use that means it does at any time. So, if I go for like my normal time, in about 25 minutes. Oh, I didn't read what it said. I think it said something about crouching for stealth. Keep watch for oh, let's change guns quickly. I have no idea. What oh, okay, man. I got some flesh stuck in my teeth. Well, that is gross, and that means they're cannibals, so that's not good. Oh god, they got pistols now. Get away! No! Down! Get away! Alright. So it looks like four bullets in the chest area, or a few in the head to kill. I think these guys have pistols now. Yeah, they do. Oh, that was... Why is it so bad though? They hit one them with this. Alright, well, there went that dude. Where'd the other one go? There it is. I just threw like a new machete at me. I don't even know what he threw at me. It was just scary. I think there's another guy. Oh, there he is. Some of these guys are really hard to kill. Why do you see like a Colt and I have a really crappy looking pistol? Oh, there's one of the balloons again. I'm not coming around for a while. I shot you in the head. You should be dead already. This is not good. I don't know where anything is, so like honestly I'm fighting this so blindly right now. Oh, he threw his knife at me, okay then. That's fine. I need... Ah! Oh god, I didn't kill him. What the hell? That's ugly bandages. Oh, okay. Bandages give you like instant... Wow. I didn't realize it would give you like that much health. Looting the bodies definitely does good though. That gives you so much more ammo. I yeah, I get money on top of it, but I don't know what I can do with that money, because... I'm assuming... Whoa, okay. I bet though he had, like, turn the opposite way to come get me. Oh, okay, this is where... Oh, okay, it's... Whoa, okay, it's much higher than where I got dragged up from. Well, I, well, I guess it makes sense to see how my other kill room would be so high. Oh no, get down. I'm like trying to make sure I don't miss anything. Because I really don't want to with hardly being able to hardly playing this game that much. Ah, oh, grenades! No 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 Oh where the hell? Not good, not good, not good. I should try to use, I'm assuming I need to try to use my bandages as little as possible. So what was it telling me that I could do to switch grenades? Oh, okay. Um... Is there a way to... Oh, okay, it's already assigned then, so what do I do to... Oh, okay, I use... Alright, so how do I throw them? Oh, same way I use the bandages, okay. Jeez, this, okay, then that was graphic. Oh, I can't loot the bodies if I blow them up, that sucks. Oh, I mean, do they leave anything on the ground? No, they do not. <sighs> okay. Just around. I need those. I need those really badly. So I'm assuming, like, the higher you go in difficulty, the less health you have, the more damage your enemies 
do, and then on top of that, um, I'm assuming that there's just less ammo for you. I think I said that. Alright, so now I gotta find my way down. I think the beer you use for money. Turn money, anyways. Alright, more grenades. I can use those. Got you by surprise. I probably should have meleeed him, but that's okay. Alright. Wait, what's that do? Oh, I didn't do anything. Wait. Did it? Okay, I got those two. Alright, so that takes care of the guys then. Is there anything else here I'm missing? I like how when the music dies down, that's how you know there's no enemies left. It's just like a lot of other games. But I have to say, the music effect in this game is amazing. So does the like, gameplay in general. Like, the controls are simple, except for like the reverse jump and stuff. Oh, okay. That's so cool! I've never really played games that you can use zip lines. I think um one of the Call of Duties I played you can. And I think that was a long time ago. That's so cool though. Okay, so then am I going back out there? Oh yeah, I gotta go back. Okay, so I'm gonna go back talk to Haggard. I think is how you say it. But Wasteland here. I'm gonna go ahead and sprint across this. I really don't want to stick around too much now because I took them all out. Oh, nope, oh my gosh. I really don't want to fight stick around now that I took them all out. But I think really a bad idea. Alright, should I get out of here as quickly as I can? I'm gonna like beat up my guy like in the back that looks like he's entirely bald. And then you look at him from the front and he's just got this whole head of hair. I wonder if it's meant to do that. No, it's not you doing there. I'm just sitting out there in the middle of the open like that. He's probably gonna have some kills. Okay, I think you can hit this. No, you can't. Okay. Oh, I mean, it may be possible to use um, a different. Uh oh. This isn't good. I just went off the gas here. This really isn't good. Uh oh. Looks like they got attacked pretty bad. There's no one even outside, so I'm gonna back this in instead. That way, if I gotta use it again, I'll be right away, ready to go. I'm gonna visit Halo the Haggard Sound Bender. Good work. We're all a little safer because of that. Good. You got our thanks and that suit of armor I promised. But as you can see, we got other trouble. Yeah, that's pretty obvious. The settlement was attacked while you were gone. A bunch of bandits we've never seen before. They didn't take anything, they just came for the kill. We have some good people hurt. And we're running low on medical supplies. Okay. I'm gonna need your help again. But I already helped you. Ah. I, I swear, I'm too nice in this game. Just past the hill across the way, you'll find another settlement. Okay. They tend to stick to themselves, but they're friends. And they have to. They'll know what to do. Could you help me again? So, ban the sure settlement and you have to get the other off with your own body. Thank God, not killed. What do you say? Um. Back my medicine, I think. Okay, so. Oh! That'd be nice oh, to get a little you. buggy out of this. Now, before you go, man. Um. The letter is probably just gonna be something I can't use or read. 
Still can't craft um, more ammo now. God. Um, head over to our settlement. And oh, okay, I got 25 bandit kills now. You got everything you need. Ammo, wing sticks. If um, not, see Alec. He's right under the old sign out front. Okay then. So you need me to get you more stuff. And I can visit Halleck, the vendor, for the little settlement, which I'm guessing he is right there because there's a big neon shop sign. But I'm going to go ahead and save this right here. And that is all the time left that we have for this episode, guys. So I really hope you enjoyed this. Um, I'll be making more later on in the week for this series. For now, it's just going to be this one episode, and there's probably going to be a lot of parts to this if I play it all the way through to the very um, end of the game and stuff. So I hope you guys enjoy this, though, and please, um, you know, just, uh, really don't know what to say here. Um, just really hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you guys in the next episode.